Assalamu alaikum, this is Xenomex. Welcome to today's tutorial. I'm going to show you how to remove the dates from all the photographs that you've taken. Now, it gets quite annoying sometimes when you've got a really nice photograph and at the bottom right corner there's a date, a really bright yellow date that just literally ruins the image. So, I'm going to use two examples. If I drag both of them here. Okay, so I decided to choose two. One of them is going to be very easy because it's got a white background to it, and the other is going to be a little bit harder because there's more than just one color behind it. So let me go to the easy one first. Basically I'll just make sure that I've got my layer selected. Then I'll go to the clone tool which is here. I'm going to pick a rather large size. I like to decrease the hardness, make it zero because that will make a soft brush and it's better than having a very crisp sharp brush. So increase the size. The size of your brush depends on the resolution of your image. So I'm going to go to the white bit. What the clone tool does basically, you tell it to take this white bit here and place it here. But you do that by holding Alt and then click. Now I'm going to go here. Now I'm, go I'm going to keep going clicking, 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 clicking. I'm going to keep doing it. And now the date's gone. If I zoom out, right click, fit on screen, there is no date, y you can't even spot it. So that was easy. I'm sure everyone can do that. But now let's see the other picture which will take a lot more time. Now all you've got to do, because this image is portrait, I'm just going to rotate it. Image rotation 960 W. Doesn't matter if I got it uh, you know, the right way up or not. I can still do the same thing as long as it's wide and simple for me. So now I'm going to go to the clone tool once again. And I'm going to right click and I'm going to make the size small. Okay, now I'm, I'm simply going to do the same method. I'm going to hold Alt, and I'm going to take this texture from the tiling and just keep clicking. But I've got to be very careful. Why? It's better if you keep clicking a lot. So if I make a mistake like this, I can just Control Z, Control Z. When you Control Z once, it'll undo. But when you do it again, it'll redo. So if you want to undo more than one step, you do Control Z the first time and then Control Alt Z to keep to even undo it once more. Yeah, so we'll just carry on doing this. Okay, now I'm going to be zooming in to the pink coat and see if I can get some colors of there. But I've got to constantly be changing where I'm taking the texture from. Also, I'm going to be decreasing the size just for extra accuracy. So now I think I've finished, so I'm going to zoom out, I'm going to rotate the image again to 90CW, it's up again, I'm going to click Z, right click, fit on screen. There you go, the date is gone, and you can't even see it at all. It doesn't even look like there was ever a date to start with. That was a very, very simple method, I find it easy, I hope you found it easy as well. If you enjoyed this tutorial, remember to check more tutorials on my channel. There's also more guides, reviews, and unboxings. See you later, and remember to subscribe. Thank you very much for watching.